No, you're good. No, you're good. Okay. You're good. Okay. One, two, three. Let me get another one. Good morning, good evening, whatever time you're watching this video. You can't really see me because my hood is on. Okay. Hey. Hey, it's my birthday, guys. So comment below happy birthday to me. And we're at the Biltmore or Baltimore? What is it? Biltmore State. Biltmore State. Ooh, I walked eight miles to see the garden. <laughs> no, not that much. <laughs> it, said, it said eight miles. Is it really? Yeah. I don't think it is. See, I walk eight miles. <laughs> but. We'll let you guys know when we get there. And we made it, guys. Look at that house in the back. Look at this property. Alright, guys, we made it to the top of the hill. This house right there. Made it to the statue. One little dog. I don't know, is this thing haunted? I'm not walking in here right now. This thing's. A little bit creepy. There's vines everywhere. It reminds me. It reminds me of Doctor Who, if you've ever seen that. The angel that's on there. Oh gosh. Uh, yeah, I don't know what we're gonna do. I don't know if we can go inside the house. I don't know if we have to wait later on. But we're gonna see what's gonna happen. We still have like winery and stuff to do. So stay tuned for that, guys. Let's get back to the. Right now we're walking towards the house. So we'll see if they let us inside and see what's going on. It looks like they're letting people in. So. Well, no, it's because they might have regular tickets, and we have the candlelight. I don't know how it works. We're not. Guess we're not going inside the house yet because we got the light ticket, so we'll see. We're going to the garden though, so yeah, stay tuned for if, that. If we can figure out where it is. We'll, we'll figure it out. Figure. We'll figure something out. Alright guys, we made it to the garden. This is the wall of garden. Yeah, the wall this of garden. Is. It's a bit, well, there ain't really anything in the garden here because you know it's winter time. So, I'll give you guys a B-roll of the property real quick. So, it's not really, not really much to see, but there's a big it's greenhouse. Really pretty, though, it is pretty. It's colorful. Like over there, it's really colorful. I really want to see all these flowers bloom in the springtime. When they come alive, that would be really beautiful. Yeah, like and subscribe to this channel right now. So I'm bringing content, vlogging content, car content. I might step away a little bit from the food because COVID, but I'm gonna try to bring what I can. You like those flowers? Yeah. That's cute. They're so pretty. That's cute. But this is what it all looks like behind me. I bet it's beautiful in the springtime. Yeah, I was just telling them that too. I mean, if you definitely want to come here as like couple, anniversary, or whatever, you know, it's a beautiful place to go to. Babe, how much you say you spent on this? Um, for the candlelit one, it was like $240. Alright, so it's, it's like two. She said it was 240 for the candlelit one, I guess, at nighttime. For Christmas. They have, for Christmas, like, they light it up. We, light stayed, up the house. we stayed at the, um, the inn at Biltmore, is what it was called. Yeah. And it was really nice, too. Uh, and... It was 150 to stay at the inn, which is really nice. It was like a studio one. I didn't really record it because it was late and I was tired. But it has like a bed, washer machine, sink, refrigerator, everything in it. A huge shower. Huge shower. I'm a big fan of hotel showers that are big. But walk through the garden right now. You see behind me. And I'm going to walk this little path. When you see all this in the springtime, it probably might be life changing. There's like a greenhouse coming up. I don't know if we can go in it. But apparently if you come to the Biltmore, you can drive your car around and see different areas. I'm a, oh.
hope you guys enjoyed the garden. I uh, put a little b-roll of that. Now we're going to the shop, which I guess when it was open, they had a lot of flowers in here, but there's like little pot. Dog guard, dog guard. So definitely check this place out, guys. Oh, this is cool. Ball right there. You can see me. This is definitely a long one for my house. Look at this. Big, huge gargoyle. What to say? If you put a gargoyle by your house, it means you're you got something to be messed with, man. Look at that gargoyle, man. Look at that thing. Vicious. We made it to the pond. And we're on this nice little bridge right here. The pond is over there. And we're about to walk to the boathouse right now. And I walk back and loop around and see the pond. Are you, are you oh, you want to walk to the pond? The you wanna... I don't care. We can walk down there. Uh, and then go to the garden. We're going to walk to see the boathouse first. Let's take <laughs> Made it to the waterfall, guys. Take a beautiful look at this waterfall behind me. Look at it. Look at it. There's finally a waterfall here. You guys have seen my last video. We walked all the way here for no waterfall, but there's actually a waterfall here, guys. Let's see if I can get closer to it. guys we're about to go to the rhinery there's a couple of lights up so stay tuned for the nighttime view of this that's gonna be at the end you guys are gonna enjoy the light show that they're gonna put on for us and we'll see you in the morning oh. <laughs> just taking a little bit of pokemon go break guys yep until we eat up oh, something out of my eye <laughs> right, taking a little bit of pokemon go break before we eat we're gonna eat it cedric tavern here this got a snuffle oh can you see it? Can't see it. Oh, there it yeah. is. Yep, so, see you guys when the food comes. Yeah. Alright guys, we're in Cedric's Tavern right now. About to find out what she wants to eat. So good. Oh, horrible. This is not for life. Oh, we're gonna order some food. Yeah, I'm gonna order some food. And we'll get back to you guys. We're about to do some wine tasting, guys. We're about to do wine shots. <laughs> no, it's wine tasting. About to do some wine shots. I'm joking. About to do some wine tasting. So we're about to taste all these wines. Limited release. Reserve Chardonnay, Ooh. North Carolina. Limited release. I can't say that word. What's that? I don't know. Guasa Sang Minor. It's definitely German. Walk inside the minor. No, that's not. I don't know. <laughs> Christmas, Baltimore White. I think we had that last night, right? Yeah. And then re limited release orange. Let's go. Limited release. We're going to taste all these. Gotcha. So, guys. This one right here a is a Sauvignon Blanc. Hence, a tested coconut, key lime, and oak. So, I'm going to get that right there for you guys to read. This is number one. Ready? Cheers. Love you. Love you too. I like that. Blandish? No, it's just kind of dry. Yeah, it's, it's, it's not dry. It's not it's sweet. Dry. It's really dry. But it has a sweet aftertaste if you guys like that. Those orange blossoms in there. Really nice, really nice. This one, I don't like Chardonnay, but I love okay. this Chardonnay, my man. It All right. pleasantly surprised me. It's like, it's not, I usually, Chardonnays are so mild. Yeah. It's like, it doesn't do anything for me. Mm -hmm. That one's got taste to it. it okay. It's got nice flavor to it. Okay. It's really good. I like that. I like that. So we got the Chardonnay, full, good, highlighted by uh, citrus, mm -hmm. tropical fruit flavors. Good. Oh my then, gosh. Smells good. Which one was that? The orange Muscat. All right. It's limited release. So. It's limited release orange Muscat. Of course, she goes with this right here. And I go with the Chardonnay North Carolina. Probably my favorite one in the world. Is that one bitter? It's fruitful. 
It's very fruitful and citrusy. It's fruity and citrusy, yeah. This, yeah, taste, this tastes a little tasty. Uh, I'm going to taste, taste all of it because I like it. Just taste it. Okay, the orange muscat is my good. Favorite. It's good. So I already know what kind of bottle she's getting now. Yeah. It's time to spend seventeen dollars, which is not bad actually for a glass of wine. Seventeen dollars usually what's the one I get. All right, she got the tip of Neo. Oh, wow. Right here. Oh. Excuse Let's see. It says dried fig flavors and smooth. Alright, so go ahead and taste it, tell me how it is. Okay. It's dry, like right? It. it tastes like um like a homey kind of taste. Okay, good. I, I can I see where he's coming from the whole fireside. Good. Kind of good. Shit in drunk right there. You know, flavorful citrus flower. That's pretty good. Which one was it this? Here, yeah, I'll look a little bit in it for you to taste. Let's see, let's taste see, she likes it. What do you think? I'm gonna taste her. Can we drink it all or? Yeah, go ahead. Oh, yeah, that's really dry. Oh. Oh, man. All right, take it for the next one. Good. So she got the mall back yep. right there. Oh, and I got the petite Syrah. Blueberry and Oh my gosh, I got the petite Syrah right here. I'll taste and see how it is. The petite Syrah is more, it tastes more like a socialized wine, something that you're at a party, you don't really want to be there. So you just take this wine and sip it, and just like, uh huh, yeah, and you just walk away from somebody. That's what it tastes like. He's right. Uh, uh, it, it tastes like something that you would eat, like something that you would drink when you're eating something. Okay. So the mall back is taste better when you're eating something. This one right here is when you don't want to be bothered. <laughs> Pretty much, that's what it tastes like. All right, next taste. All right, I got the Gewürztraminer right here, and then she got the Century Sweet Wine. I'm gonna taste Gewürztraminer first. You can say girls on wiener, but you say Gewürztraminer. <laughs> this one, actually, I would drink. I would drink this one. I would drink it because it has the fruit flavors. You could taste, actually taste the fruit flavors in this one. Really good. You want to taste this one? No, I'm good. Okay, I'll drink it all. Yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> That's my party one right there. The diversion is my favorite one that yep. we have right now. That's the party one right there. <laughs> what does that one taste like? It's good. It's really good. It's really sweet. It's, sweet, yeah. sweet, rare it's one? sweet, sweet. Okay. It's good. I'm going to take her word for it. All right, guys. Tune in. I'm going to show you guys some lights. If not, I'll show you the part two. Now, key information. If y'all a little bit of light action for you guys. Okay. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh. What you gonna do? That's pretty. I want you to take a picture of me. Oh gosh. That light's hanging from trees, guys. Thank you guys for watching the early video. If you do, like and subscribe. Stay tuned for part two, which is inside the house. All right, guys, stay tuned for that video. Okay. Which one? Say anything to him? I'm good. You're good? All right, she's good. See you in, guys, part two.